about to begin my career mode, and here's the player that I made. He's a center, standing 7 feet 3 inches tall, 275 pounds. He's ripped, nicknamed the baddest one, number 99 from UNLV. He's about to become the greatest player in NBA history. With the 60th pick in the 2014 NBA Draft, the San Antonio Spurs select Jeremy Brown from Oklahoma State. Nah, this guy? Man, he's terrible. Good night, everyone, and thanks for coming. There's my guy. Your guy? Your guy? Your guy was told by his agent that he was going to be a late first round, maybe second round draft pick. Your guy's supposed to be in New York with the rest of those chunks. Your guy? Your guy's about to blow his freaking lid because his dream of being in the NBA is still just a dream. Hey, chill, man. I know this isn't how we wanted it to go down. Believe me. Like I told you, you're my last best hope at the agency. If you wash out, I wash out with you. But I was thinking. Maybe this was the best thing that could have happened to you. How you figure that, genius? Better to go undrafted and have a choice than to be picked late by a stacked playoff team where your chances of making the team are about as high as my chances of dating a supermodel. Which, despite my contagious charm, are pretty freaking slim. So what's the move, man? This just affects our timing, okay? You just gotta keep working hard and be ready. Injuries, overhyped draft picks, sooner or later players are going to wash out and they are going to call you. You hear me? Yes, I hear you. Good. Remember, Jordan was cut from his high school basketball team and made fools pay for it the rest of his career. Use the draft day slight as motivation. A chip on your shoulder at the beginning of a long journey. And like every journey, this one begins with a single step. So your first step? is to keep working hard, and we'll find you a home before you know it. All right, man. I'm believing in you, bro. Make it happen. <laughs> okay. I know you've been staying in shape, working hard on your game, waiting for your shot. Yeah, so when's that gonna be? Because you told me not getting picked was a good thing. It was. It was. This is America, freedom of choice, and all that good stuff. And that is why I'm here. Now is the time. Teams are able to offer 10-day contracts at this point, and I've been on the phone nonstop. There is some definite interest in you. What's that mean? I get to pick where I want to go? Oh, it's not that easy, my friend. But there are several teams willing to give you a little tryout, see if it makes sense for them to sign you. Listen, man. First of all, you're not my friend. You're my agent. And second, where's the list? Because I'm ready to play. Keep in mind that these teams have varying levels of interest. If you want the 10-day deal, you're going to have to work a lot harder to impress some of these teams than others. Man, I don't care about that. Where's the list? Okay, here's the list. Let me know where you want to go and I'll make it happen. Man, I saw your pre-draft workout, and I can't believe you weren't picked. But good for us, because here you are with a chance to earn a spot on our roster. But the competition gets a little steeper here. You're playing against the best ballers in the world. You'll be running with the twos against the ones. You've worked your whole life for an opportunity to play in this league. Now's your chance to make it happen. Hope you're ready. Hey, I'm more than ready. This right here is my destiny, and I'm fixing to grab it and take it in my own hands. I got this, coach. Oh, that's my board. Yes, sir, let's go. I'm a point center. Who's running with me? I'm like a mix of Magic Johnson and Wilt Chamberlain. Yeet! Oh, come on. What do you mean, bad shot selection, man? Give me the ball. Thank you. Oh, post moves. Spin move. Get in. Hey, look at that. I've got the moves. Whoop! Rebound. Go. Yeah! Look at him sky for the rebound over Kenneth Fareed! 
Oh, crossover. Oh, and the dunk. Oh, nice pass. Oh, get off me. Yeah, that's what you get for flopping. I got a C plus grade. Pick and roll. Give it to me. No. Yeah, you should have passed that originally, but I got the rebound out of it. Ten seconds left. B minus grade, so I'm going to make the team either way. But I'm going for the win. Oh, it's no good. Yo, rookie. Huh? Some of my colleagues thought it might have been a fluke. What? Said there's no way an undrafted rookie could be that good. All right, so what do you think? I think you can do it every day of the week. You sound like a smart man. And the smart man has some advice for you. What's that? Tell your agent to stay by his phone. That's right. If there's any way we can get you here, we will. Move, man. What are you doing? We got our foot in the door. The Nuggets have offered you a 10-day deal. Why not a year? Because you're an undrafted, unproven commodity. But they saw enough to take a flyer on you. So you have exactly 10 days, 240 freaking hours to show that you belong. You perform, you got a shot at a guaranteed deal for the rest of the season. We both live to breathe another day. You don't, you got a shot at being last in a long line of might have beens. And I'm probably out on the street too. Living in this rat hole. Hold up, rat hole? This is all I can afford, because you didn't get me drafted. <laughs> Let's call it a charming fixer-upper. Now pack your bags. We're going to the show. Yeah, boy. I'm going to the league. I got my foot in the door, and I'm going to kick this sucker down, man. <laughs> you better. I don't want to ruin any more suits sitting on these vermin-infested couches of yours. Man, this is my house he's talking about. Finally, I'm in the league. So you're the work you that's gonna shock the world, huh? Sure as heck gonna try. Good. I'm glad you're here. Just remember, it's all out there for you. Work hard, listen, watch how we do, and you got a chance to be something special. Now let's see what you got. Thanks. I'm happy to be here, man. I'm pumped. Let's do it. Don't even give the fans a chance Psst. to get into the game. JaVale! JaVale, we're on the same team! Do you want to hang out later, JaVale? Oh, give me that! Oh, come on! My inside scoring is so bad! Nope. I, I want to shoot that, but I know I'll just miss it. Gotta go to work in the post! Oh my gosh! Hey, there we go. Got the offensive rebound and the bucket. That's mine. Here we go. Point center. Tragic Bronson on the break. Shoot that. No. I wanted an assist. There we go. Oh, come on. There you go, Mozgov. Pick and roll. No. Come on. What did I do to deserve that? Now I have a C-plus grade. Great. Why? What am I supposed to do? It's like Chris Paul is magnetized to me. I'm trying to get set. Ah, shut up, coach. I'm better than you. JaVale. Oh, JaVale. Yes. JaVale McGee with the assist. That's the dynamic duo. I actually could have had a B minus grade if it wasn't for this two illegal screens and getting benched the whole fourth quarter was a lot of fun. That's what you get, coach. Don't bench me the whole fourth quarter. How am I supposed to make the team if I don't even play? The bad news is, you play like a 50-year-old rec league bum, and we lost the game. You're supposed to ask me what the good news is. What's the good news? The good news is, I don't think it's possible for you to play any worse. Is this supposed to be making me feel better? Nah, man. It's supposed to make you understand that it ain't just you. 
We all got work to do if we're gonna do something special this year. So put this one behind you, learn from it, and move on, all right? Yeah, all right. But a 50-year-old bum, though? If the shoe fits. Come on, man. Hey, Rook, keep your head up. Oh, whoa, Coach Rivers. Hey, I'm sorry, man. I just I ain't playing very well. Yeah, everybody has down nights. Don't dwell on it. I've seen you play. You've got game. You'll bounce back. Just keep working hard. I will, for sure. Thanks again. Yeah, get out of here. Don't come in this paint. Nice block, Griff. I'm running the lane. Oh, mismatch. Mismatch. Power him down. Okay. That's fair. Drew Holiday with the steal. I can't even take advantage of that mismatch. Roll. I'm wide open. Thank you. Yeah. First bucket of the game. I'm trying. Oh, mismatch. What? Are you serious? Is it every time I touch the ball on him? It's a steal. Oh, here we go. Nope. Okay. This is scripted. Three times in the post against Drew Holiday, and all three times he steals the ball from me. Okay. Well, they spent a lot of that game in the air and got their hands on a lot. Get out of here, man. I'm seven feet, three inches tall. I should be playing point guard, but I'm not sure what coach is thinking there. Oh, get out of here. Two blocks in the same possession. Oh, and Anthony Davis was down. Coach to coast. Get off me, Jimmer. Oh, of course. Yeah, I can't post up. It's an automatic steal. Robinson passes to Battistone. Please don't steal this. Assist. Yes. Oh my goodness, he actually made that. Here's Holiday. No good. All right. 46 to 42. We are down by 4 points going into halftime. Yes, guys, I'm here. Shut up, Doris Burke. No one cares. All right. Oh, what is this? Still anyone's ball game right now. Nah, shut up, coach. The first half. No one cares, coach. Welcome back, everybody. The start of the second half getting underway. Both teams. And so Wait, what? Comes out on top here. The game's and over. Oh, we won. I just got benched the entire second half. I'm sorry, coach. I'm sorry I told you to shut up, man. It's my fault. I was just so hyped up, man. I'm sorry. Oh, man, this is not looking good. After my 10-day contract is up, it's not looking like I'm going to be in the league anymore. Why you tripping? We just pulled out a nice little win. Tripping? Don't act like this game was never in doubt. It was a lot closer than it should have been. That's a problem. We weren't taking it serious enough. Like we could just show up and win. One thing I know for certain, we take something for granted in the NBA and it all goes away. You right. When we got somebody on the ropes, we gotta knock them fools out, man. Yo, tonight, we was just barely good enough. Straight out. Next game, we step on the gas and never let up. Let's do it. Got it dialed in yet. Use it. Come on. Wide open. Good pass. Oh, and one. Get off me. Costa Kufis. Don't bring that weak stuff in here, man. Yo, you're lucky I didn't yam that on you. I'm 7'3". How did I not dunk that? And, of course, I missed the free throw. Got him. Assist. There it is. We're playing like Randolph and Gasol right now. Assist. Yes. No! Rebound! It's good! The putback! I'm pretty sure I was just getting triple teamed right there. Not sure why. 
We're down by 10 though, it's 41 to 31. Hopefully we can make a comeback and finally win a game. No, okay, it's 62 to 44 now. Not sure how that happened. Oh boy, look at this. We get an interview with Doris Burke. How are we gonna get back in it? Yeah, let's get the politically correct answer. They came out strong and got hot from the floor. Can I just say how awesome I look with a pink headband and the goggles? Yeah, we'll see. Oh man, it was an honor, Doris Burke. Thank you so much. Oh great. Look at this. I get subbed into the game and there's 30 seconds left. Oh! Fabulous! Of course, it's an illegal screen. As soon as I come in, I can't do anything. I mean, this is useless. I need to get a higher grade in order to make the team. But if I'm not getting any minutes, especially when it's a blowout like this, I don't know, man. I got to step it up in the coming days. I'll get a block right here, though. No, just kidding. Can't even get a rebound. Hey, there it is. Oh, I'm going coast to coast. Get off me. I'm not passing this. I got a B plus grade, so that's kind of decent. Oh, no! That just happened! They called a charge, but that just happened. I dunked on someone. I think we're about halfway through the 10-day contract. Right now, it's not looking so bad. I know I'm going to get more minutes in the coming games, so I'll be able to prove to the coach that I belong. And, you know, maybe if my mentor was JaVale McGee, I would have a better chance. U-G-L-Y Man, Ugly doesn't even begin to describe what happened out there. What would you call it? Sorry, pathetic, garbage, embarrassing. Just gotta let it go. Get back at it tomorrow, study some film, see what we did wrong. Hit the weight room, get some treatment, make up for it next time out. Good idea. The quicker we get back out there, the quicker we can leave this nightmare behind us. Let's hit it.